Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to episode number two of The Rich Mentality. Within today's video, it's all about chest. Nothing new in terms of exercises, um, but the passion is definitely back. It's reignited. We're gonna start off with a couple of presses, moving into some uh, wide dumbbell flies. We're gonna hit some body weighted exercises, some cables, another dumbbell exercise. And let's get in uh, and on with the workout. Uh, first exercise, incline barbell press. So uh, let's get to it. Exercise one, we're back on the old incline bench press. And you can see I'm, uh, I'm pushing the weight up a little bit more than I have done on my past videos. This is all part of my quest to try and get back into some real weight training and kind of go heavy. So, uh, progressively building up the weights, a couple of warm up sets, and, and then uh, kind of quickly up to my, my main working set for about six reps on here. So, talking about uh, technique on this one. Pretty wide grip, but notice my elbows. As I'm pushing up, it's as though I'm trying to bend that bar. I've kind of got this external rotation going on on the bar. And by doing that, I'm not as strong. I'm not able to just push raw weight, but I'm really engaging and squeezing more pectoral muscles than I would if I'm just trying to drive that weight up. So it's actively and consciously engaging those muscles, contracting them, forcing them up at the top. I'm getting a nice smooth, fluid motion back down, driving back up, and really squeezing those muscles. What I am trying to do within these workouts is work my chest, or rather break down those muscle fibers, create those micro tears within the muscle fibers through an array of different exercises and movements. So I'm getting a lot of depth on this one. I'm really bringing the, uh, the dumbbells down to practically alongside my chest. That's something I can't do with the bar because the bar will stop me about here. So even just an extra inch, inch and a half or two inches of travel can make the difference to open out that chest and uh, allow for some more of those micro -touch. It's not for everyone. I like to go full depth with a lot of my exercises. Um, that's on me. I kind of start with pressing or multi-joint compound type movements. Uh, now I'm into more of an isolation type movement. And that's basically what we're doing with this exercise. I'm taking my elbow long past that point of where my body is, that horizontal point. Opening down to about here. Slight bend in the elbow. I'm going even deeper. Getting a really great stretch in that chest, which coupled with that weight resistance. Think about how much extra muscle trauma I'm able to create from that, as opposed to just going heavier and going through a limited range of motion, at least for me. So I'm looking to get the maximum amount of weight I can move with the widest, longest range of motion. And that's where, once again, Chris comes in to spot me. Just a little bit of pressure on the elbows. We're gonna talk a lot more about a spotting technique over on the Facebook video. Therefore, it's just a little bit about shoulder height. So once I'm leaning forwards, we keep our chest up. Got a nice full sweep coming around with the arm, and again, maximum travel in that pectoral to be able to squeeze and hold that contraction at the end of the rest. Enough weight on there first. Smooth, fluid, and consistent. Fixed arm. Just do all the work. So with the dumbbell pullover, I like to use a heavy weight, but still with good form. You see I'm going for a full range of motion. I'm holding on the underside of the dumbbell. I'm not holding the, um, the actual handle like this. I've got my palms open in that diamond shape holding the underside. So my wrists are acting like a rudder, allowing me to Position, keep that weight vertical as I'm taking it back down. Big deep breath in, I'm opening up that diaphragm. Breathing all in as I get that stretch. It's a good stretch in the chest too. And then exhale, be sure to check out the Facebook video that me and Chris are doing right now, where we're gonna talk about uh, all these uh, different topics and questions that him and I have been talking about throughout the workout, in particular about spotting. So uh, on my Facebook page, the link's gonna be in the description, check it out. We're gonna be talking for 10, 50 minutes um, and just kind of bouncing back and forth about why it is that we do what we do. So thank you for watching. I'll see you guys soon. Episode number three coming soon. So check that out. Take care. Train hard.